We have a Canadian twist tonight on a medical experiment that began in Mexico a few years ago. Doctors there began transplanting insulin-producing cells from pigs into people, people with type 1 diabetes. This was very controversial research. It did show promise, but it was ultimately abandoned. Now, however, researchers in this country have picked up where the Mexicans left off. CTV's medical specialist, Avis Favreau, reports. 13-year-old Sam Golis is one of very few in the world to have undergone an experimental treatment for diabetes. Four years ago, he traveled to Mexico, where he was infused with insulin-producing cells from pigs, a controversial animal to human transplant. While it didn't get rid of his diabetes, he now uses about 20% less insulin because the pig cells appear to be making some of it for him. It takes less insulin to contain it. It was a big improvement and it was a big step and every Canadian should have an opportunity to have it done. The pig cell transplants seem to work in other young diabetics to varying degrees and the treatment doesn't require any powerful anti-rejection drugs. But the Mexican study ended and was never followed up on. Now Canadian researchers are taking a new look at that intriguing question. Could pig cells treat diabetes? There's no doubt in my mind that the treatment that the patients got in Mexico was of benefit to those patients. Dr. David White and a team of scientists have been refining the technique and are conducting new detailed studies to answer the questions the Mexican research left unclear. And they're in discussions with the U.S. Food and Drug Administration for further experiments. We can make it work much better than those initial I think very courageous studies. Depending on the results of some upcoming animal studies, researchers hope to begin testing these pig cells in human diabetic patients as early as the fall of 2009. In terms of a potential treatment of people with diabetes, it's feasible. If it works, it would have a massive impact. And watching from the sidelines will be Sam and his family who have already seen signs that the technique works. Not perfectly, but enough to give hope that diabetes may well be treated with cells from pigs. Avis Favreau, CTV News, Toronto.